Hey guys, what's up? This is Prince is doing an online commentary battle for Room to the World multiplayer. I am playing as the Thracians and my opponent is AVB playing as the Germanian tribes. I have three archers, six phalanx pikemen, two ballistar, um, two general armor bodyguard, and two militia cav. My opponent has four spear warband, four axe chosen axemen, not just axemen, but chosen, and then four chosen archers, and then two uh, got the cavalry. I thought since he's gonna move up, I'm just gonna sit back for a little bit and just shower some uh, archer fire on his men. So we're hitting some of his men right now. And they're getting mad. Just look at these chosen axemen. <laughs> anyway, something defunction with my line, and I wasn't really sure what it was, but still, the um the fight came in my favor. I hurry up, put my men in the phalanx, and just fought off them guys as best as I could have. One of uh, Thracian's uh, strengths is their phalanx, if used right. And also these guys right here. So I got tied on the fight here with his uh, axeman, and um, now I'm gonna try to fight off his gothic calf. But I only have 24 against at least a um, hundred gothic calf. But while he's fighting my guys, he also has javelins getting thrown in from his back, um, thrown in his backs. So that's not good for him. And then I have uh, archers showering the backs of his guys as well. Over here, um, one of his line is broken, but now he's throwing his axemen at me. And those axemen can just obliterate my phalanx. So I had to reinforce my phalanx with that uh, unit right there. Over here, I just maul through these axemen, hoping to kill his guys. I mean, I got this unit over here coming towards to help out with the fight, but they get there too late. But oh well. So this unit is pretty much surrounded, but I'm still shooting um, archer fire into their backs. So at the time they get there is the time where they break. So it's pretty bad. Anyway, his line's completely done. So yeah, so I'm gonna just charge in my militia cav, hope for them to get something going here. And when I charge them in, they um, the gothic cav and pretty much rotted immediately. Um, my Belisari um, has come back, and then another unit of my Militia Cav have come back, so that's pretty good. So I got my Militia Cav here, and three archers, and uh, one uh, main cavalry unit. Right here I go for a strike at his, uh, the enemy general is running away! This is no way for a leader to behave, but in battle, it is beyond belief! So I got a strike on his archers here, but they're not going to do much because he chose the right thing by just attacking my guys. And when he did that, you can just see what happened. I just don't have the strong cavalry to um, really attack his guys now. So I'm pretty good. The enemy general flees. Press forward so that the spirit of his army is a broken tool. Yeah, we already know he fleed. Uh, he fleed once already. But anyway, yeah. This battle was a requested battle by one of my viewers, um, King of Thrace. He's new on YouTube, and um, yeah, he requested his battle, and he uh, loves the Thracian history. Yeah, that's always cool. I mean, I love ancient ancient history, and um, Seleucid, um, ancient Greek history, and the Thracians are just a, another Greek faction. So I'm going to have my archers come up here, just trying to um, skew down some of his guys. To hopefully uh, weaken them, so when I go in for another cavalry strike, that my guys won't get the, um, won't get destroyed as easy. So I actually routed. No, never mind. That's not even a, a cow, um, archer unit. So his main infantry body pretty much is routed. Now all he has left is his archers. I'm gonna go ahead and fast forward it because all you're gonna be watching um, if I keep it going is mainly some uh, missile fire and I switched to flames just to try to scare his guys away so I'm gonna stop recording and I'll get to you in a second right here I threw in some more of my cavalry hoping to kill his guys but then he charged again and that's gonna route 
these two units again. So there they go right there. So there goes my guys. But while I was trying to range his men, I'm still gonna fire into his backs. The way I'll stop recording and I'm gonna see you in a second. Right here, I'm just gonna charge. Um, spread out my men a lot. I actually have them like from here to here, and that's actually where I got them running to, so they can just pass by these guys and hopefully kill them on the way to their destination. And as you can see, I spread them out a lot so um, that they be as big as possible. So I'm maneuvering my phalanx right now, ho hopefully to kill his archers. So his guys, I'm um, gonna charge into my phalanx. That's really not gonna work. Throw this, try to take this unit right here and put him around the side right here, and then charge him to try to surround these guys. So I got my guys in phalanx and that's gonna get them to route right here. And I also got this cavalry unit right here coming in for a good strike for some revenge on the guys that we lost in those uh, earlier. To, a um, victory is yeah. not quite a glorious day. The enemy fought well enough to stop and not to defeat. That was an average victory. I had 1,026 kills with 554 men remaining. AVB had 840 kills with 215 men remaining. Good game to AVB and uh, thanks for watching and thanks for requesting this uh, battle. Later, bro. Later, guys.